So what is the concept of a Bond girl? Well, a Bond girl, when you hear that expression, you automatically think of a beautiful girl, a very uh, sexy looking girl. Exotic, exotic. Spending time with Ursula Andress is like spending time with a force of nature. We filmed for an entire day together in Rome, and by the end of the day, she still hadn't run out of things to say. Ursula's a legend, the quintessential Bond girl. You are the most remembered of all the Bond roles. Actresses we've interviewed, Ursula, Ursula, Honey Rider. Why is that? I was a new kind of woman. You know, I represented a new uh, type of woman because before you had the, the Monroe, you know, the, the voluptuous roundness, and then I come as an athletic woman, uh, sportive, strong, determined. Probably that made an impression and gave a success to, to my character. I promise I won't steal your shells. I promise you you won't either. How did you get the role in Dr. No? Well, my ex-husband took a photograph of me, which he took with him going to Europe, and Harry Saltzman saw that photograph, and when they were working on the script, he said, that's the girl we want. I said, where is it shot, this film with whom? Oh, Sean Connery. He was unknown at the no, time. No, I didn't know him. So I said, OK, send over the script, and they sent over the script, and that day, Cook Douglas came over, and we were there all together in the living room, and he read the script, and we laughed, and we laughed, and he thought it was very funny, and it was very bad to me. I thought it was not a good script at all, but then I was very happy about it, because I thought, if I accept that script, at least it's not going to be my fault that the film is bad. What are you doing here? Looking for shells? No, I'm just looking. And the day I had to meet Sean, I remember the only thing, he was sitting alone in this dining room, all alone. He was dressed all in black. <gasps> and I was walking there, and he was looking with his eyes like that. He was looking around. And I looked at that man, and he looked very, very strict and very... I was a little scared, so I said, hi. <laughs> and he said, hi. And we began this way. The next day, we had to work. And I was a little timid and a little... But at least I was happy. I had a lot of action. So this was easy for me to do action. I'm going to run around, and that's OK. But then he was adorable to me. He was very, very nice shot to me. And he's still adorable to me today. 